hi guys i don't know whether this is me starting a vlog or not but either or let me tell you what i've been doing for the past 30 minutes i came to vio in victoria island because i had to redo my car papers and um, they expired and so there's meant to be like a car inspection section and baby <laughs> the journey and the struggle to get here because I didn't think this thing was this deep. Oh. I don't. Um, for roadworthiness, they have to test the car. I mean, it's it's great that we're having things put in place. It's just the inconvenience, baby. Especially with this current weather, it's just not. It's not giving cute. You know what I mean? I went to the gym. I went to swim. I had a meeting. Took that after swimming. Drove here thinking I'll be out in like 10 minutes and here I am at 35 minutes. I am tired. I am hungry. It is 3.12. I ain't eating nothing. I've got bananas with me, but I am exhausted, guys. What is, what's going on? Let me flip it. This is what I do while I queue. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that dog. Even the compound in itself, bro, is just... It's giving all sorts of weirdness. I'm just like, if they don't tell me this place, I would have said lie, lie. But it's not possible. But I pass here we are. So yeah, that's where we're at. Anyways, so I'm still here, Sha. I'm about to be answered, I guess. I don't know. He said when I get to the front, and my car is the second car. I wind down. I leave my keys in the car. And then I go and sit there where everybody else is sat under that beautiful shade. And um, thank God for sunscreen, bro. I'm just, it's a lot. And I'm hungry. I'm also bored of eating the same thing. I'm tired. I really feel like shawarma and like chips from like Marocaine. It's a lot of money. And I'm trying to save money right now because... But I'm just giving. I'm tired, guys. Like, no cap. I'm actually tired. And a lot hasn't been happening. I mean, I have a wedding on Saturday. Um, my friend is turning 40 again. So, you know, I'll definitely give you... Ah! I have to empty my phone for that party. Ah! Yay! Yes, Kelebe. Latifah's 48. I must remember to even carry my um phone lights so that everybody is looking i'm hoping that i'm going to look lit because i don't really know between myself and carrying we're going back and forth should i wear the 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 theme is club renaissance right and if you know then you know so i don't know am i doing shine shine sequence top skirt dress screw screw i don't know what i'm doing guys but I'm definitely going to give them ponytail because I'm doing a ponytail for the wedding. The wedding too, I'm, I don't think I'm going to show the wedding, guys. Maybe a small clip, but I don't know, guys. I have a headache. That time of the month is coming soon. My sleep is still not patterned. I don't know what is going on with my sleep, y'all. But my sleep ain't patterned. There's a billy goat that is walking loose in this joint. You guys, hold on. Look at the goats. Yo, that girl taking a shit. You know, when I was walking on this road, I saw shit on the floor. And I was like, wait, do they have, like, animals here that they're rain? Y'all just saw a dog. Now, that's a whole goat. Listen, that goat is freely walking around. Freedom. Eating grass. Under the sun. Collecting life. Chilling. Ain't got no worry in the world. Just me, me, and all around the place. Wow. Hi, goatee. Who doesn't want this kind of life? Walking around naked. Not knowing what's going on. I feel like I should greet the goats, but I'm not sure the goats will greet me back. Looking at that billy goat, and I'm like, that billy goat is going to me problem. Problem. I didn't get my certificate. So I have to come back tomorrow morning. Settle the guy and then get my certificates. Lagos now. Wow. Nigeria, which way?
you guys this is still the same day by the way so my general Larry, i call her general Larry because she was my junior in secondary school but she's my sister now anyways let's move on so we're sitting here we're talking and she's like oh my god senior bimbo oh more i was looking at my fridge magnets the other day and i saw a picture of myself at your 30th ah, senior bimbo, that was eight years ago i'm like first of all shut up it's not eight years ago it's seven and a half what years shut up seven and a half years ago she goes senior bimbo, that your birthday was lit i said wait generally you know what i spent on that wedding on that birthday because might as well be wedding mm. she said how much that birthday party cost me three million naira 30th birthday that that 30th i can tell you people for a fact that i did not have fun <laughs> where everybody that was at that party they had fun i carried food home child day people were full ice cream ice cream has a renee ah! small chops grills the drinks unlimited dj sb DJ people SB. dance foul show beside show beverly naya yeah. everybody and showed it and it was an all black party Listen, that party was lit. That party was lit. Oh, ah, but it was after that party that I knew that I'm not doing a party <laughs> again. Yeah, 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 yeah. That party was I'm not going to do it. It was mad. You had fun. Ah, I danced the Friday. <laughs> <laughs> no, everybody came to meet me that oh, being born. Oh, my God. That party. I see people calling me from left, right, and center. Oh, I heard you're having a party. Can I stop back? I said, Oh, be this. We people. were there till. We were there till late. Yes, and there was traffic that day. So people Serious came traffic. So people will now, now came late. Came late, I remember. Serious traffic that day. <gasps> me, I was worried that nobody would show up, but why? Oh, Mama said, to now showed up with her own friends. friends. I said, Oh, me, well, guys, I didn't have seats. Oh, I didn't have seats. No sitting, everybody came all black. I remember came all, I, I remember my crop. I even was on Bella Nigel. <laughs> Bella Nigel featured my 30th birthday party and I didn't pay. <laughs> Listen, that was eight years, well, seven and a half years ago. Eight years, so Shut up. It's not approximate. <laughs> no, November never reached. Okay. I'm still a young girl. The point I'm trying to make, guys, is listen. I've been in this game. Been there, done that. Period. Without Side making out. noise. Yep. I didn't even have up to a hundred followers then on Instagram. <laughs> we, 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 we have like a photo booth. There was a photo booth. There was, booth. There was a 360 free. photo booth. Yes. yes. That's how I have. That's that how you have that picture. Uh-uh. I should actually send you a picture. You know the funny part? I have the book of it. It's in my mom's house. Really? Yes. Now I got people to. They took. Everybody took two, two yes, pictures. And then people they put signed. One and they made yes. Design. Yeah, uh -uh. I remember seven and a half years ago. Sexy, what do you put? No, with my sexy thingy. I even had hashtag. I should look for the hashtag. Yes, there was a hashtag. I need to go and find the hashtag because I'm sure it's still it's still up on ah, IG. Party was, party was lit, lit. I'm just telling you people <laughs> that don't look at me with regular eyes. When I do things, I do big. Yeah. Period. <laughs> Sign <laughs> Signing out, Bimba. Iraq out. Ladies and gents, why is this weather right? Why is it out here looking like it's going to rain? I don't need rain. I need sun. Nangi mini, don't make nobody come Hey, you guys, if I tell you people that I had to come back here, it's not a joke. Not only did I have to come back here, I had to pay 40,000 naira. So apparently there are cameras in Lagos. And my vehicle license and my road worthiness expired in February. I didn't notice it had expired until March when I went to renew it. Um, so apparently camera took picture of me or of my vehicle and flagged it. So for me to be able to get this, my road worthiness and to be able to clear and get all my papers for my car i had to pay forty thousand naira so apparently twenty thousand for expiration of vehicle license and then twenty thousand for um expiration of road worthiness and so i just ended up paying forty thousand naira that i did not plan for early this morning thinking that i was just only going to come and collect certificates but they can't give me certificate because it will not print it out because it's been old 
and so i'm doing this video again to just let people know that listen lagos state is not playing you know? when i say people to do tax people did not listen to me now i'm telling you people now even with car anywhere they will collect from us they are collecting gone are those days where they will let things slide or at least systems were not being put in place to make sure that things are done due diligently because let's be honest anywhere else in the world these are documentations that have due processing and must be done right we've just lived in a country where these things were not done for a long time and so now that these systems are being put in place it's frustrating because first of all there's no acknowledgement or announcement of the fact that these systems are being put in place but you see this is how you know that a country has really something far when they need to announce Oh, by the way, we are starting to do the right thing. No, in case you put, you know, we are doing the right thing. No, in case you don't know, we are doing the right thing because. So wake up early morning like this, forty thousand fear. So that is already setting the tone for the rest of the day. I'm going to lock myself inside my house because I don't have it. I've paid for it, but I don't have any extra. If you shake me like this, that's my own money for the week. But it's crazy. But the long and short is. I've got my roadworthiness certificates and so I pretty much am cleared. I'm just, I'm tired. This country is stressing me out. 40k. No be beans though. Alright guys, I'll see you guys later. My sweet people, how far? So I have a wedding that I'm going for, but the truth is, I can't take you guys because we're not allowed to record. So no recording, no nothing at this wedding. I'm just getting back from doing my makeup. I'm going home to dress up. When I finish dressing up, then I'm going to go to the wedding, but I cannot take you with me. These are the situations. But yeah, hopefully I should have fun. Um, I've been having cramps, but I feel better. So, yeah, but it's about to be a lituation. My dress is very modest, so my makeup had to give a bit of a je ne sais quoi. Shout out to White Glam on this beat. Listen, she's definitely missed my face. Don't worry, I'm doing a ponytail. So my hair is slicked all the way to the back. And then I'll put the tail when I get home. But yeah, I love this makeup. And I just said, let me tell you guys that I'm looking what? <laughs> Been bought too much money, period. Anyways, all right. I'll see you guys later. Bye. God forbid. Nobody has ruined me. Nobody will ruin me in Jesus' name. This wedding that I'm going for, that I cannot see where I'm going. Hold on. Let me see where I can put my phone. Because, guys, this setup is a very minimalist setup, and I'm not about to go on. Hold on. Hold on, guys. Okay. <laughs> when they say the extra is extra, KK Kaka, Kaka KK, I go do fascinator. You would say, say something they happen. The, anyway, this is the dress. I will tag the lady who sent me the dress, such a sweetheart, from Abuja. It's a very modest dressing. This is here because I don't want my makeup to stay in my dress yet. So I'm not taking it off yet. But yeah, my ponytail. My ponytail is ponytailing. You know, and the back is doing a lot of things. So I'm, I don't know what it's doing. But anyways, we shall thank God. Everything is okay. <laughs> Guys, when I tell you that I've never felt this extra in my life. I'm not even joking, like, ah, hey, now nah, maybe it is, I will dress, so,
package from the people at Good Molecule. I'm super excited to try the brightening toner. Thank you guys so much. What? What do you have in your fridge today? You brought me something and yet you're asking me about my fridge. Because you know that I always take something from your fridge. And you always have plenty of food in your fridge. I don't have food, girl. Because you always give me food. Girl, bye. What's in your fridge? Let's go and check. <laughs> you should, you should, you look, look at this one. <laughs> look at this one. Bye. Your cake. <laughs> As a good friend, I brought my friend to come and do photo shoot for his baby. And my baby girl indulged me because it's why it. Hi guys, what's up? So this is very weird and very random. This angle is weird because I didn't plan to shoot. But anyways, my hair is a lot. And for the past two, three years, I have not washed my hair by myself because it's just a lot. <laughs> and then I live in Lagos now, so hair, is, hair, hair was affordable then. Now hair is ridiculous. Like the price of things is just crazy. Anyways, long and short, I did my hair a week ago because I had an event. And then I have to weave it now again. I did a ponytail. Videos will be in this. And I carried that for a week and a half. I was a ponytail. They had to gel my hair, put me under the dryer, all that good stuff. Anyways, it's been a week and a half. And now I have another event that I need to compare for. I, sh I shall have work. And I intend to wear a wig for the duration of the work. So I have to wash my hair and wave my hair. And I was going to go to the salon and then I went online to go and book my appointments and stuff. And I saw the cost of things and it just wasn't costing. And I'm like, listen, I couldn't have spent almost 30,000 to do the ponytail, steam, wash, do the ponytail. Come and spend another X amount of money. And I was like, you know what? I'm gonna wash my hair myself, okay? So I washed my hair myself, um, finished washing it, trying to blow dry it. It's still a bit wet to be fair. To be fair, it's wet. And so, shout out to my girl, Tammy. Um, she got me this blow dryer. And so that's what I'm using to blow dry my hair. So, I sectioned it. Hold on. So I'd already sectioned it prior to this. And that's why you see it's a bit stretched out. Um, I'm just trying to do it again because the girl is already here to weave my hair. So.
not my camera not my camera struggling to focus but anyways this is the hair shower right now i still need to go around it but i can't lie like one of the things that you can do to just make your life a bit more convenient would be to get like a blow dryer like this i'm sure if me, i'm sure you guys in america would chant you guys already have um this kind of appliances in your house because you don't have to do your hair yourself but so i'm sure but anyways yeah um i'm tired i need to blow dry this hair well because but i'll keep trying <laughs> i will keep trying and yeah this is the hair this is the back i don't know what you guys are saying but fear is a very interesting thing because look at me now doing my hair because i'm choosing to be Ijebo. again this angle is very weird but in this vlog you probably going to take it as it is now i'm using my camera before i was using my phone <laughs> guys take me as i am man a lot is going on a lot is going on but your girl is looking good the skin is skinning and it is all thanks to good molecules i'm going to do a video of my nighttime routine to show you guys they sent me some really amazing products which i'll put in this video but then i'm also going to show you guys how i use the products because the skin is skinning my skin is glowing i told you guys i well i don't know if i ever spoke about it but during covid i started having at well just before covid like two years before covid hit i noticed that i started breaking out around my period time and my hyperpigmentation was going crazy and listen the skin was just skinning okay it was doing a lot and so over time i have gotten the hormonal acne in check however the end results were a lot of black spots or dark spots um not blackheads just dark spots so i have great skin my pore is alive and well and speaking but i have dark spots so we're trying to clear it up and the good people at good molecule sent me some products that i've been using for a while going on like what week three and i love it i love it <laughs> i love it anyways guys let me finish but i said this baby's almost here all right i'll talk to you guys later or oh, i'll see you guys next time I listen we're gonna roll with the punches okay okay not the girl that's meant to do my hair here already hello lydia Uh, his name is Paul. Tell him you're coming to Bimbo's house. Okay, I'll come and open it for you. All right, bye. All right, guys, I gotta go. <laughs> bye bye. Hi guys, what's up? So we're back, and I'm finally officially using my GoPro 10. See, this vlog is going to be all over the place. I've used my iPhone. I've used my camera. Now I'm using GoPro. Say hello to my partner for season two. Guys, Buki so in uh, uh, now is disgusting. Like, I do like perfection. But you see, with things like this, I don't mind slight stoves. Like, anything can go. But my sister never. <laughs> I don't like this part. <laughs> I don't like to count. <laughs> Anyways, Ola, say hi. How are you today? That's good. That's good. It's Ola that makes, makes some dreams come true. Why wow, this one is here? If you don't get that camera out of Break what? I'll break you first, girl. Oh, that way, though, uh, that that we did. That's it. We'll be back. All right. Today we're eating from the nylon. Nylon things. Wow. Shooting in 4K. This is mad. Small girls be gotta. Small girls be gotta. Big girl, that big is girl, big girl. This baby's annoying, man. <laughs> we're lying. I don't even have the energy. In you case know? some of you were wondering, of course I wore a wig. We finished shooting. <laughs> the moment inside the nylon wasn't bad at all, but everything else was bad. Like, why do you, why why do people eat from nylon bags? Let me know. Is it because of time? Is it because of cost effectiveness? Is it because of laziness? Let me know. Yay. Goodbye.
Hi guys. So I'm at rehearsal for a show, not a show, a conference that I'm hosting with MC Ajala. It's going to be dope. It's for Lagos State. Hopefully I can record some things, but I'm tired man. Today has been a long day. So at rehearsal, we're going to be here for a minute. So yes, for those that don't know, I do compare and host events. I just don't post it. <laughs> but yeah. We get in the bag this year, so we're showing everything that we do. Okay, all right. But no, if you're doing the color of what exactly it is, it's fine. It's all just it's red aesthetics. Anybody that's true. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you Abin Balakre. Oh wow, when I present to you, MC Angela. You are doing well, sorry, you have done well. Oh, period. Hosting this event has fed me, but we came through. We shall finish. Let me be going to my house. I don't know how I'm going to close out this vlog, but I'm tired. This outfit, the man's is looking cute, but I'm tired. Hold on. Something that I thought was going to be four hour event, five hours max. I got here at 8 30. I left rehearsal at 12 midnight. I got here at 8 30 for an event that was meant to start at 9. Um, we didn't start till 11. We're just finishing. I'm tired, but I'm super grateful for the opportunity. I honestly enjoy comparing. I don't talk about it a lot, but I do occasionally compare events um especially branded events and it's always just nice especially when people want like a proper compare host not someone to come and make you laugh not someone to crack jokes someone that just has a great command of english and can just literally help your event flow sign me up those are the kind of events that i like and this was one of them so shout out to the latif jack on day leadership academy headed i was spearheaded by the executive secretary aisha i'm so grateful thank you girl um yeah this was good times man it's always good to always do things out of your comfort zone um and this was one of them but now man's is hungry man's is tired and i need to go eat shower and sleep so i don't know vlog what they what or what this vlog is but we vloggy vlogging okay okay cool all right Bye guys. Let us appreciate this flat 17 studios ready to wear new collection dress because baby, this baby kept me together all day on my feet, everything coming through like bing did a ding. All right.